everyone. So it is Monday, April 25th. It is 12 o'clock and I am headed home for my lunch break. Um, I'm super hungry. I did want to do a what I ate video. I might do one every day this week. I'm trying really, really, really hard. Um, I'm just frustrated at myself that I didn't lose anything last week and yes I am feeling good however I don't know I just feel like the scale should be moving I feel like when you get closer to goal I totally see why or how it could start stalling a little bit or you could hit a plateau but when you have nearly a hundred pounds to lose like myself I feel like it shouldn't slow down you know so maybe it's something that I'm doing unconsciously I don't really know so I wanted to do some what I eat videos to see if that helps me along and if that's what I need to do to stay on track or get the scale to move or something then so be it I'll just have to try everybody's um, suggestions of maybe editing as I go throughout the day so you know so that's what I'm gonna try to do today edit as I go the weird part is, and I don't know if you guys are like this, is that I like to watch my video. So like I will put all the pieces together and edit it together. And then I'll go back and watch the whole thing over again to make sure I didn't miss something, to make sure, you know what I mean? And I feel like that wastes time, but I'm always so afraid to just upload a video. Like, I don't know, without watching it back. It's just like turning in a paper without proofreading it. It just like, I'm like, what if I say something or what if I do something stupid? Um, I do not like my hair today. I have it pulled back like I used to all the time and that's simply because I was feeling super lazy and I did not feel like doing it. Um, as I said before, I have naturally curly hair so unless I take the time to blow dry and straighten it, I really can't do a whole lot with it. Or I could put a ton of product in it to leave it down and curly which I just honestly don't even have those hair products. and. I don't like doing it. I, it leaves my hair either super crunchy or sticky and I just am not a fan. I like, as you guys know, I touch my hair a lot when it's down especially. So I don't even use hairspray when my hair is straight. So the only two products I have at home is hairspray and some dry shampoo. <laughs> anyway, that was totally off topic. So here was my breakfast. I had uh, English muffin for three plus, plus points. Three points plus, I believe it's also three smart points. I had an egg for two points plus, which is also smart points. Smart points, smart points, smart points, whatever. Um, I had a, maybe a tablespoon of blackberry jam, which is one points plus or two uh, smart points. And then I had my coffee, um, which I don't think is in the picture. And that was one point plus or two smart points. So I am doing points plus. So for me, that was a seven point breakfast. And that might sound gross to you guys, like eggs with jam. But if you guys like that salty, sweet combination, the saltiness from putting like salt and pepper on the egg and the sweetness from the jam is really, really good. And, ooh, I don't know what's happening right now. One moment. Okay, sorry about that. Everybody stopped because a car was trying to get out and a tractor trailer was trying to get in. Yeah. Anyway, um, so yes, I'm, oh yeah, yeah, sweet and salty. So like the combination of the two is really, really good. Just like if you put like butter and jam on a biscuit or on an English muffin, it's like that saltiness of the butter and the sweetness of the jam. It's super, super good. Um, and my blackberry jam does not have any seeds because I do not like seeds. Um, I tried putting raspberries in my oatmeal one day and the flavor was really good, but the seeds, I just couldn't deal with it. I wanted to throw in the whole thing away. Speaking of oatmeal, I'm pretty sick of oatmeal, so I'm kind of on an egg kick, so yeah. But anyways, uh, that's all I have to say for now. I just rambled for way too long, um, as always. And so I will show you what I'm having for lunch. Hey friends, here is lunch. I totally started eating before I recorded this because once again, I forgot I was doing a video. Um, it's weird how you get so used to doing something and then you try to start doing it again and you like, you know what I mean? Anyway, 
Um, I am having six point lunch, six points plus, and I think it would probably be seven smart points. But I have one of the chicken egg rolls from Walmart. Um, if I recall correctly, they're only three points smart points and they're still three points for points plus and i have a little bit of low soda low sodium soy sauce and some sriracha on there and then i have a gigantic salad like look that's a pretty gosh darn big salad um in it i have one point of my rotisserie chicken breast like all like pulled apart and then i have for two points um some catalina dressing um i have a spring mix salad um, it has carrots in it, but I added more shredded carrot. I added cucumber and I added tomato and I added some orange bell pepper, which is like in there. Um, yeah. And I'm learning to enjoy salad without cheese or croutons, which I'm pretty excited about. Um, I have those crunchy onion things in the cabinet, but they're points and I'm trying to be really good this week. So, yep. And... I've kind of sucked it up this morning on water. I did have some iced coffee. Um, so this is still my first, but I'm confident I will at least get my second, this and my second one down before I leave work. And then that will leave me one to drink with dinner and then I'll have the rest, the last one for the rest of the evening. So um, yeah, I'm pretty confident I will get my gallon in this week or this week <laughs> today. So I just tried to drown myself. I was trying, like, when you get to the bottom of this bottle, it like trying to get the little bit of water over like the lip here. It like all came rushing out and like, well, yeah. Um, <clears throat> I just thought I would share that with you because, oh my God, <laughs> thank God it's only water. Did I already say that? I feel like I did. Hey everyone. So it is quitting time and I'm actually not headed home. I have a bunch of boxes I need to take to FedEx, which I'm not excited about because the way the parking lot is and the sidewalk, it like... It's, it sounds really strange like they're on a corner like of a strip mall kind of thing and um, where you park and where the front door to FedEx is it's like you park you could be at the very first parking spot and you have to walk so far and I'm all about walking but do you guys see how many boxes I have so I'm that person who will carry every grocery bag in that I can I'll carry like 50 pounds of groceries in um, I have to stop at the bank first. But yeah, so I'm hoping, the last time I was there they had a hand cart right at the front. So I'm hoping that they do again. Um, but yeah, I have to go to the bank first because then after I leave FedEx, I'm hitting up the grocery store because we need a few things. I haven't, <clears throat> When I went to the grocery store the other day, I went to Walmart last week and I got some stuff, but like I wrote a list and like, I still feel like looking in our fridge, we have nothing, which is really weird. I'm not getting a ton of stuff, but I want to make a dessert. We're having a cookout tomorrow for like a charity kind of event for my work and it's for the Ronald McDonald house. And um, the the two guys, the install manager and our, our sales manager, they went together, two dudes went together to get our food and like, I don't know, I just feel like I need to bring something. So I'm gonna make a Jello poke cake. I don't know if you've ever heard of that, but they're really good and you can do any flavor cake or Jello. And so I think I'm gonna do lemon and lime, like lemon cake with lime Jello. It just sounds really good. And if you've ever had a lemon poke cake, they're very, very moist. I said lemon poke cake, a jello poke cake. They're really, really moist and um, really good. So anyway, I'm gonna go to the ATM. I'll be right back. Hey everybody, so here is dinner. I have one of these bags of the California vegetables with cracked pepper. Um, and then I have like five and a half ounces of grilled chicken. Well, I cooked it in the skillet. Um, I just seasoned it up. And so, yeah, it smells really good. And um, zero for the vegetables, and it's 
four points her the chicken, which I actually counted six ounces of chicken. So, and then I am now starting my third quart of water. So, um, oh, and as I was cooking, cause I was starving, I just did a grocery haul, but I had, um, a serving of these, which is ooh, 30 grams. I don't know if you can see that. Um, and it is four points, but <clears throat> so yeah. It is 7.25, ugh, already 7.25. And I just finished eating and I'm trying to get through this third quart of water so I can go to my fourth quart. Um, yeah, I've used 23 points for the day and it leaves me with 20 points <laughs> left over. I definitely will not be eating 20 points. So anyways, yes, I will talk to you guys later.